allowable stress limit for the dynamic analysis are higher than the static analysis. Are you thinking why this happens? Come let's turn the pages to answer the same. Well dynamic load cases are by default considered as occasional cases. As such, the allowable is K times SH, where K is an allowable increase factor defined by the code. Hence, where the allowable for the static analysis is SH, the allowable for the dynamic analysis or occasional load case is K times SH, where K is an allowable increase factor defined by the respective code. Further, let's have a case study. In a 12-inch piping section of a launcher piping system, a valve gets added. What effect does this addition of valve has in the analysis of loads and stresses? Well in order to know more about this case study, kindly click on the link below or continue watching this channel. Channel which tries to explain some of the basics of oil and gas piping and moreover of the piping stress analysis. Please do subscribe in order to get more facts, cases, and quizzes.